Chile earthquake could have shortened the days. The seventh strongest quake in recorded history may have shifted Earth's axis. Yes, it was that powerful. The massive 8.8 .8 earthquake that struck Chile may have changed the entire Earth's rotation and shortened the length of days on our planet. A NASA scientist has said the earthquake, the seventh strongest in recorded history, hit Chile on Saturday and should have shortened the length of an Earth day by 1.26 milliseconds. According to research scientist Richard Gross at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory in Pasadena, California, perhaps more impressive is how much the earthquake shifted Earth's axis. NASA officials said in an update. The computer model used by the scientist and his colleagues to determine the effects of the Chile quake effect also found that it should have moved Earth's figure axis by about three inches, eight centimeters. The Earth's figure axis is not the same as its north-south axis which spins around once every day at a speed of approximately 1,000 miles per hour. The figure axis is the axis around which the Earth's mass is balanced. It is offset from the Earth's north-south axis by about 33 feet or 10 meters. Strong earthquakes have altered Earth's days and its axis in the past. The 9.1 Sumatran earthquake in 2004, which set off a deadly tsunami, should have shortened Earth's days by 6.8 microseconds and shifted its axis by about 2.76 inches or 7 centimeters. One Earth day is about 24 hours long. Over the course of a year, the length of a day normally changes gradually by one millisecond. It increases in the winter when the earth rotates more slowly and decreases in the summer. The Chile earthquake was much smaller than the Sumatran quake. But its effects on the earth are larger because of its location. Its epicenter was located in the earth's mid-latitudes rather than near the equator like the Sumatran event. The fault responsible for the 2010 Chile quake also slices through Earth at a steeper angle than the Sumatran quake's fault, NASA scientists said. So this makes the Chile fault more effective in moving Earth's mass vertically and hence more effective in shifting Earth's figure axis, NASA officials say. The scientist said his findings are based on early data available on the Chile earthquake. As more information about its characteristics are revealed, his prediction of its effects could or will likely change. The Chile earthquake has killed more than 700 people and caused widespread devastation in the South American country. Several major telescopes in Chile's Atacama Desert have escaped damage, according to the European Southern Observatory Managing Team. A salt measuring NASA satellite instrument destined to be installed on an Argentinian satellite was also undamaged in the earthquake, JPL officials said. So, in other words, the Chile earthquake actually shifted the figure axis of the Earth. It moved the Earth. That's how strong it was. And it has shortened the days. Just like it says in the Holy Bible. Mark chapter 13 verse 20 And except that the Lord had shortened those days. No flesh should be saved, 
but for the elect's sake, whom he has chosen, he has shortened the days. Again, chilly earthquake could have or may have shortened the days. And again, these are more signs of the end times, transition days. The transition is happening. It is a process. It is increasing. And it is in effect. And these are more signs happening daily all around the world in many different ways.